Now we're going to need to have fast times from these athletes here today because there are 17 competing, only four spots available to go to the finals. And Bentley Boyd is starting his attempt to get a solid place in the place. But look at that link through dropping boxes. Yes. If you're familiar with the Southeast Regional Ninjas, you, should, you will probably know Bentley Boyd, who was third place at the World Championship this year, won the power skill, got second place in the tech skill. Bentley has a lot of the abilities in his arsenal. And we're seeing a massive sprint out of him right now. I couldn't even finish hyping him up. He just got straight. <laughs> These times are getting faster and faster. We saw Mia put up a sub-minute time at 50 seconds. And then our first male athlete, 44. And now Bentley with 41. How fast do you think we're going to get today? And now we have Bentley Boyd. It's like getting out of the water, having a good time, and then seeing a shark go <laughs> immediately <laughs> out of the waves. Bentley Boyd is known as the always ninja because he's always doing ninja. They even put lights on his backyard rig, it says, so that way he can do it at night. Um, so this is definitely someone who knows his way around a course, definitely knows how to maneuver his body. Now we'll just see if he can navigate his way through the mind of Brett Sims and currently toss up. Well, the always ninja is going to always need to keep moving on this course in order to get a fast time. Quickly through the toss up and on to jumping spider. Bentley yeah. is one of our taller athletes here today, so using that reach to his advantage, we'll see how he does on the spinal tap obstacle. Now in order to qualify for finals, Bentley's going to have to beat the course in under 2 minutes 32 seconds. That's going to put him in a minimum third place which means that with one runner left, he will be safe regardless. Currently on the bubble is Angel Vega with a time of two minutes, 42 seconds to deja vu, which Bentley is absolutely slashing right now. A whole minute and 30 seconds left and two obstacles to go. I think we'll see a nice reach up to the ring first try. Here it is, the dismount. Loads of time for that final work wall obstacle. I think this is going Speeding to be right up time. And it is by about seven seconds. Kaylin Kaminsky had a clear in 149, and Bentley Boyd coming in at 142. Now, Bentley's time was just about a second and a half slower than our next runner that's coming up. He moved very quickly. You see him executing these moves with. Such precision, such confidence. Yeah, he and really, our, I want to see that swing on the, yeah, look at the amount of power he built up in one move on Deja Vu. That is the type of stuff you expect to see from Bentley. Absolutely our, great run. 